Fitness Patrons, my name is Robin Bretzig and I'm here to share with you one of my favorite hip workouts. It's called T30, which means every exercise is going to be 30 seconds long, and then we're going to take a 15 second rest in between. We have four rounds we're going to complete today, and I know you're going to love it. So, equipment you need is a mat, or you can even use a towel, because I know everybody's at home right now. Who has a mat, right? A towel looks great, something soft to lay on. If you have weights, Go grab those weights if you got them. If not, soup cans are awesome, or you could use milk cards if you really want to be buff and tough. But anything you have access to, if you want to add a little extra resistance, go ahead, but you don't need it. Today's hit workout is all body weight workout, cardio, strength. We're gonna have a great time. So, are you guys ready? All right, here we go. I'm gonna start the music, and I'm gonna start our about time. Get warmed up here. All right, you guys, ready? Just nice and easy, breathe in, here we go. Hop. If you're early in the morning, you definitely need to warm up. Later on in the evening, not so much. But here we go, you guys. Good. Playlist of how key it is, kind of a bunch of oldies. If you're like me, born in those babies. I love that music. So we're going to use that today for a warm up. Now bring those arms down to the middle. Here we go. Up. Oh, man. This quarantine stuff, I tell you, it's just great to be moving. Nice. Now tuck it in. 
Gonna hold that for 30 seconds. You're looking quick, keep going. All right, go. Now, this is high level right here. If you need to bring it lower, you can take one knee and put it down, or you can even do both knees if you need to. So, high level or lower level. Pick whichever level you fit. Fits you and lower. We got 30 seconds. This is awesome. It's so fun to be back with you working out. You guys are amazing. Hopefully you're all finding fun ways to get through this time. Good. And time right there. Okay, going to the second set of that, right? So starting with those jumping jacks again. You're awesome. So you've already made it through one set. Now we're making the second set the first round. Are you ready? Get ready those jumping jacks. And here we go. Good. So I know that me and my kids, We've been doing a lot of fun stuff. We've been going hiking. We've been playing some soccer tennis in the backyard. Playing some pickleball. Trying to get out. Still maintaining our social distance. But it's been fun. And enjoying the time that we have. So, I encourage you. Find the things that you like to do. And get out and do them. So that you're not trapped inside. Um, we have a great backyard, hopefully. Somewhere we can go. Awesome, jumping jacks are over. Getting ready for squats. If you have weights, you can pick up that weight for that goblet squat. If not, three squats are great. All right, toes forward. We're gonna sit back and those heels. Are you ready? Here we go. Our next 30 second here. Okay, showing that technique again. Sit back in your heels. Chest stays tall. Head up, push back in the heels. Oh my heavens. Good. I love squats. <laughs> love squats. Eight push ups. How about that? There you go. You guys are doing so good. Good. A few seconds to go. Stay on those squats. Good. Come on. Push it out. Woo! Alright, that finishes those squats. Now we're going to those push ups. Remember your different levels. Knees up, knees down. You can get. I'm going to angle a little bit so you can see me here. All right. Are you ready for these 30 second push ups? And go. Good job, you guys. Keep it nice and tight. Now remember, this is the high level. Knees down. That's the low level. You pick whichever one fits your fitness level. And it doesn't matter. Because every day, as you work out, you're going to get stronger. And you're going to find that sooner or later, if you're here, Stretch 
whatever you need. We're going to start this next round in 10 seconds. Are you ready for round number two? Here we go. All right, round two is going to start with my favorite exercise of all time, burpees. Okay. Here we go, 30 second burpees. Good. Now, this is the high level. High level burpees right here. If you want to go to a low level, you can just do jump squats, or you can jump, put your hands down, walk out, and walk in. Jump, hands down, walk out, walk in. Or if you have access to a chair, you can jump and do the burpees on the chair. Put your hands down. So, you can. Whichever level you want, that fits your fitness level. Good. Nice. Okay, going to reverse lunge. If you have weights, you can grab those weights. We're going to do 30 seconds on the right leg and then 30 seconds on the left. So, get ready. Right leg, here we go. It's back and up, and you can do a bicep. Good. Now, if you don't have weights, that's okay. Just curl those arms up. Good. Nice. Now, on the back lunge, keep your weight right in the middle. Keep your front leg, front knee behind your toe. So, you should be able to look down and see that toe. Good. I'm coming straight in. Nice. Perfect. Keep your balance. Low level on this is not a deep lunge, just a small lunge. Perfect. Okay. That's our break. Now we're moving to the other side. Are you ready? You guys look great. You're doing awesome. Remember to go at your own pace, though. If you go too hard the first day, you won't want to come back. So, go at your own pace. So, again, this is the high level right here. Nice, good lunge. Low level is just a little half lunge. So, I just go halfway down, come right back up. Again, it's your level. Good. Keep that weight right down the middle. Make sure you stay up nice and tall. Perfect. I'm really proud of you guys. You are doing so good. Hopefully, you've been exercising a little bit as you've been away from us. If not, today's the day to get All right, shoulder taps. We're coming down to the floor. Now there's two levels. I'm right here. This is the high level. If I put my knees down, this is the low level. Okay, are you ready? Okay, and go. So, bring an arm across and tapping that shoulder. Good, again, all about you and your pace. I love it. Nice. Now again, remember, knees down. You can even go halfway, put your knees down halfway through. Whatever's easiest for you. Good. I love it. Keep it working. Nice. Almost there. Almost there. You got it. Come on. Woo! Perfect. Now we're going to go to bicycles. So come on down right here. Okay, fingertips are going to be behind your ears, and you're going to rotate side to side. Okay? Your pace, your speed. Low level is right here. Go. Good. So this is the high level. This is the low level, okay? So pick whichever one you want to do, or start with one, move to the other. As you're bicycling, get that shoulder all the way over. Really reach. Keep those fingertips by those ears. Good. Try to squeeze that stomach down. Look up at the ceiling. Nice. Relax that neck. Awesome. Oh, and there it is. Our plank challenge for this round is plank twist. So, we're gonna be right here, and we're gonna rotate. All right, are you ready? You got this, you guys. All right, elbows down, feet up, and go. So again, this is high level. Our low level is on your knees. Just rotate, nice and easy, side to side. Perfect. Excellent. This one's really going to work your knees. So we're really working on this. What we like to call not on the Good. Come on. Woo! You can do it. Pushing that bit side to side. We're almost done. Nice. Come on. Perfect. Okay, that is set number one. Are you ready to go 
through step number two. So we're starting with those burpees, my favorite exercise. If you come to my class, you know I love burpees. All right, get ready. On your knees, get set, go. Perfect. Come on, really explode up in those burpees. Good. Let's review the low level. Little hops if you want. This is great. Or hop, step out, step in. Hop, step out, step in. Perfect. Come on. Nice. Woo! Doing great, guys. Come on. Yes. Okay. Grab those weights. Get ready for lunges. We're going to start with your right leg. So right leg for 30 seconds, and then left leg. Good work, you guys. Here we go. Back and good. Nice. Now you don't even have to use weights. You can just do lunges. Good. Or if you don't have weights, just curl your arms up. Or use soup cans. Or milk cartons. Whatever you want to do. Be creative. Get ready. How you feeling? Take a pulse check. Okay, if you're feeling like you're out of breath, take a break. Okay? Good. Get ready for the left leg. And go. Nice. Keep that chest up nice and tall. Right down in the middle. And stand. Good. Loving it, you guys. Again, like I said earlier, don't go too hard. You gotta face yourself. Nice. Okay, set those weights down, and now we're going to shoulder taps. So, feet up, bring your knees up, or knees down. You pick. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Okay, go. Tap those shoulders right there. You got it, you guys. Oh, man, this is like overall body workout right here. Using lots of muscles. Again, lower level. Nice. Okay, guess what? You just finished 
round two. Are you guys ready to go on round three? Put your hands together. Come on, I'm proud of you. Keep it going now. Get a drink. Get a towel. Wipe up. Whatever you need to get ready for round number three. Okay? Go work out. We are halfway done. That's the middle point. Look what you've accomplished so far. Give yourselves a hand. And let's get going. Okay. Round number three. We're going to start with what we call skaters. So skaters like this. Okay? Nice big push. Okay? Low level. It's just a side tap. All right. Here we go. Good. So again, this is your high level. We're right here. Really explode to the side. Low level. Keep it down and just step. Oh, man. Oh, 
shake them out. Okay, go into the leg drops. Come down to your mat. Good. Hands under your bum. Back nice and flat. High level and low level. Okay? And there's that whistle. Let's go. I had to bring your whistle into my workout because I'm a PE teacher, right? How good of a PE teacher are you? Whistle. Challenge. Are you ready? Plank jacks. Okay, one leg out, both feet. So again, here we go. This is the low level. This is the high level. Or you can come down on your knees and tap it out like this. Okay, get it. Let's go. Okay, squeeze it. This is the end of this round, you guys. This should be finished. And we have one round to go. Are you so excited? Be 
females, we gotta work these triceps more. Especially my high school students. We work on these all the time as they need it. Okay, rowing sit-ups. Are you ready for this? Rowing sit-ups are right here. I'm gonna squeeze in and out. So this is gonna be the high level. The low level is just one leg in for two, and then the other leg in for two. Okay, go. Keep working. 
and we'll walk it. Yes, go! Okay, we're on to those rowing sit-ups. So coming on down. Okay, keep those abs pushed against your uh, back. Right there. Okay, squeeze. Nice. Good. Okay, there's that whistle. Let's go. We have rowing sit-ups and we have two bangles and we're done. Two exercises left. Do you remember what low level was? Right here, low level. Two in, two in. Good. High level. Push it out. Yes. To all my soccer fans out there, you recognize this one, I'm sure of it. Woo! Got out free core, free soccer, play sports. So we constantly work on it. Nice. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, one exercise, 30 seconds, and you did it. We're going to the commandos. Okay, here we go. You can do this. Nice. Now, when you know you have 30 seconds left, it's kind of your motivator. You just give it all out. Put it out there. Come on. Don't forget to switch at five. Switch hands. Good. Another one bites with us. No, you're not going to bite with us. You're going to keep going. You cannot bite with us. Come on. And let's cool down. So down on your mat, right here. Legs out nice and straight. Take three big breaths. And down. And in. And out. And in. And out. Okay, this time take a big breath in. And I want you to lower forward. We're reaching over those hamstrings. And I want you to pat yourself on the back. Oh yeah, I did it. It's your birthday, it's your birthday, you did it. You're awesome. That was a fantastic workout. Okay, let's stretch those glutes right there. Keep it nice and tight. Sit up in that back. Good. And other side. Now remember, there are a lot of workouts that the Orm Rec Center is giving you. So make it a variety. Don't do the same workout every day. Your body starts to adapt to do the same thing over and over again. Change up your workouts. Try hit. Try high fitness. Try Zumba. If you're like me, that's like, okay, maybe not, but I'll do it, right? We'll try. Um, you know what I need? I need yoga. So try a yoga workout. Okay, go and get a lot of different variety because you know what? When you're parked inside, you can't go anywhere. It's all about variety, finding new things. And this is a great time to challenge yourself. You're in your home. Nobody's going to see you. So that's why I think I might actually try yoga because no one can laugh at me. I make fun of me. So try all these different workouts that the rec center is supplying for you. So happy that Orm Rec Center is doing this for you guys and for its patrons. We love you guys. You've been a part of our classes for so long. Go ahead and roll that nice and slow. And we miss you. I'm sure I'm speaking for everybody. We miss you. We love you. Keep it going. And remember, my last thing I want to tell you is a little progress every day makes a big difference in the long run. So keep going. Keep with it. Love you.